Okay, let's take a start. I'm going to ask you some questions about art. Whenever they talk about art in IELTS speaking, part one, part two, part three, art can have different forms. Painting, drawing, calligraphy, dance, music, all these are the forms of art, right? So let's see, do you like art? <clears throat> well, uh, I'm, I am not uh, that type of person. Uh, I don't usually like art, but most of the time, uh, occasionally you can say, uh, I can do uh, and think about and art, yeah. art about. Okay, so you say, I usually don't like art, but sometimes if I have time, then I watch and appreciate some forms of art like music and dance, yeah. something like that. Okay, do you think art classes are necessary? Well, uh, it's a very uh, good question. Uh, I think art classes are necessary because everyone has uh, their own passion. So, uh, whether uh, you are not that type of person, so uh, or uh, some people prefer to uh, take interest in arts, so. I think arts is very necessary. I think art classes are very, are very necessary. necessary. They are important. Children should be taught at school. Just link it with that. Okay. Let's go on. Uh, how do you think art classes affect children's development? Well, I don't think that art classes affect ch children development. Uh, uh, I think uh, it it is a uh, very uh, useful for children development because they learn many new things uh, by doing or watching some art classes yeah and uh, I think art it's a makes them creative yeah. also they become creative if they are involved in arts and so, all that okay let's go on uh, what kind of paintings do people like in your country uh, well, uh, generally, it's a very... Uh, generally. Generally. It's generally. Generally. Yeah. It's a very uh, good question from your side. And I think people like uh, the paintings that is uh, related to um, famous peoples uh, that we can mostly see in the museums and we can... Uh, mostly see uh, these paintings in art the, galleries uh, in art galleries or on the internet okay so to answer your question uh, i think these uh, type these of paintings type of are very popular in my country in my country all right this is better so you know they can ask you any unusual question unusual topic in part one so you should be ready for okay, that sir. right let's go on it's your turn so that's it that's it do you like bags yes i love bags and I have a lot of uh, different type of bags for myself and uh, uh, some of that bags some of those bags some of those bags uh, are given by my friends uh, and uh, all right so to answer your question answer your I question. love bags very much what types of bags do you like well, it depends on my mood. When while traveling, I mostly use the bags. The travel bags. Traveling bags, and for uh, study purpose, I mostly use the bags uh, for uh, study mm -hmm. uh, study bags. And while traveling, I have my purse. Okay, my wallet, so my wallet and all that. And all Do you usually carry a bag when you go outside? Uh, it depends. While traveling, I usually uh, uh, pick my bag with I me. I usually carry a bag carry with a me. Carry a bag with me. And uh, uh, when I, I'm free, I don't use that bags. Okay. What types of bags do you use in your daily life? I usually uh, uh, carry out my purse with me uh, in my daily life. And... Uh, yeah, along with that, I have um, a bag for my books. So if I go to attend any classes, I take my book bag. Book and for traveling, I usually use a backpack. Carry bags. 
carry bags. bags. All right, your answers are short to the point. They, they are not very much to the point, so you need to add some more detail. Okay, and the way you are answering, it's very, very serious and it becomes boring. So okay. try to take interest in the questions. Your answers should be interesting and you have to show interest in the questions of the examiner. Okay, right? Okay, right. thank you.